to get your daughter back. Okay? And whoever did this, they're going to get nowhere near her ever again. Maybe they've um, they found Emma and they just can't get a hold of us. Where's the phone? It's right there. Oh. Are you sure your cell phone's on? Yeah, it is. It's right here. It's fully charged. Penny, how about I just I go make a few calls just in case? Dixie couldn't do this alone. Dad. How could they do this to you? How could, how, how could they do this to anyone? Oh, I don't want to do this to you, Jonathan. You, you lost Lily. You took Ontario. My problems are taking over your life again. Oh, it's not taking me away from anything. I don't have a life anymore. Wait, we can go. I have to go home and get my bear. Go home and get my bear first. Then we can fly and leave mommy. Any word? No, no sign at the Miranda Center or anywhere else I can think of. How is this even possible? I am her mother. Emma's missing. Emma wanted her mommy, so... Are you okay? Are you okay? Did anybody hurt you? No. No, no. Did you show mommy a picture? Oh, that is so pretty. This is a beautiful picture. Just like you. <laughs> yeah. You are my beautiful little girl. Huh? Oh, I missed you. I missed you so much. I missed every little bit of you. <sighs> Did you miss mommy, too? Yeah. Yeah, are you tired? Baby girl, you're probably tired here. Probably because you didn't have Lulu Bear, right? You probably miss Lulu Bear. Okay, um, let's get you to, let's get out of bed, huh? Come here. Come here. Okay. How could you? Don't worry, okay? She's fine. Fine, call the cops. I, I don't care. What I need is for Annie to listen to me. Can you help me with that? Uh, are, are you kidding? You stole my daughter. You can rot in hell. I was wrong. God help me, I was so wrong. You are evil. You stalked us, then you stole my daughter. You I didn't stole her. Take her. No, you just hired an accomplice. There is nothing you can say right now that would make this all right. Can you listen right. just for a second, please? Why? It's not going to change what you did. God, you were, you were so convincing at Dad's. So concerned for the safety of Emma. Meanwhile, you had her stashed all along. I didn't know where she was then. Oh, gosh. Just stop lying. Look at this. She's home. She's safe. She's fine. And what do you want? They want a reward? You want props? For returning Emma back to her mother? No, how about a medal? For Dixie, finally doing the right thing for once in her life. No, can, can we just get this over with? Let's call the cops. I'm Shh, done with... Hey, keep it down. Emma's sleeping already. Can we just talk alone, please? Jonathan, Aaron, thank you for everything. I need to do this. Are you sure this is a good idea? I'll, I'll be fine, please. Okay. We'll be back. You want to talk? Talk. But I will call the police and have you locked up. I was going to take her. I was going to take Emma and leave for good. I was going to tell her that there had been a mistake made. A horrible mistake years ago that we were going to fix together. I was going to tell her that I was her real mommy and that we were meant to be together no matter how many years we were apart and we were going to start over. 
and we were going to fill the empty places in each other's hearts the way little girls and their mommies do. But I saw her and listened to her every time she talked about you. And I realized that she doesn't have an empty place in her heart. She doesn't need me to hold her or love her to make her feel safe because she has all that with you. So no matter what any DNA test says or how I feel, how much I'm sure that Emma is my daughter, in her heart, you're her mommy. You're the only mommy she's ever known. I can't take that child away from her mommy. So, I swear to you that even if Emma is Kate, I swear on my mother's grave, on my son's life, I'll never take her from you again. Emma belongs to you. I know that. But what I don't know, I can't take anymore. It's killing me. Yeah. Missing my daughter killed me. Did David Hayward put you up to this? Is Emma okay? She's fine. Why didn't you call me? Please. Please. Not knowing takes up every breath, every thought that I have. I don't know if I can take it anymore. If my daughter is out there somewhere, I need to know that. If she's upstairs living with you, I need to know that too. Couldn't you please just let us test Emma? To find out if she's Kate, I promise you, I will stick to my word. But can we just please know? Emma has given you so much. Can you please just give us that?